We are live. We are live. Noise. Let's have a look. Yes, we're gonna do some uh, daily races on low fuel motorsport, the last one this season. Let's have a look. Yes, all right. I'm alive at you. So, daily races, the last ones this um, season, for me at least. And I'm going to go into that server now from Low Fuel Motorsports. Doing the AMG. And I need to copy that. Copy the. First, we're gonna do Donington and then we're gonna go f to the Nurburgring. So, Nurburgring and Donington Park. I have absolutely no practice in Donington Park. But hey, that doesn't matter. Of course, it's. Oh, it's a day. Luckily. Luckily, it's a day. Normal conditions, because last time we were streaming uh, absolutely horrible with the rain and spa, but uh, now we have the normal conditions, so hopefully we can put in a decent result here. And hopefully it will be all clean and nice and whatever. So 30 seconds, we still need to wait for the qualify so let's just stand by five four three two one alex said check it flex hey out. man what's up place. Welcome, welcome to the stream. I, I was going to do it all by myself, but I thought I'd, I'd just go live and, um, you know, if people want to plug in, they can. Because I want, I, I did, I had not, I did not have the chance to do uh, races on LFM this week, so I thought to myself, uh, I'm just going to stream it so everybody can see and watch how I'm being humiliated on Donington Park because. I had no practice here, I just like made a quick setup and uh, see how uh, how I can deliver here, let's see, so I have way too much fuel in here but it doesn't really matter, this is a very difficult corner yeah, it's a little bit understeer still. Maybe I need to lower that brake bias a bit more. Understeer. Mario S, what's up, man? Welcome to the chat. I, I was going to do. Uh, <clears throat> I, I wasn't going. Uh, wasn't planning to go live, but I thought, like, why not? people can see how I'm uh, doing this last few races on uh, on LFM, yeah, on this season. And Donington Park, I actually did a lot of laps on Donington, but it was quite a while back, so I need to practice a little bit here. Especially with this Merc, I never took the Merc to Donington, so... Jan, what's up? Good evening, good luck, have fun, thanks. Thanks, Jan. 
so just uh, like this one we're gonna do and then after I'm also gonna do the Nürburgring 45 minutes so we have a nice okay, nice I'm schedule right. ahead of us Okay, first, first lap, we're going to first put in a, a little bit of a banker. I think we have an overlay issue, I'm going to fix that when we're in the pit. Then we have the steering wheel and throttle and braking input as well. Okay, this is better with the brake bias. I have actually no clue if we're going to be competitive here. The chicane is also very tricky, yeah? That next one coming up. It's the fastest lap for Walsh. 27.76 but in this Merc that's like not a, you, it's like speed bumps are actually non-existent in this car that's good yeah okay good luck oh, okay you came from the Lambo and now you're in the Merc good stuff mate I like the Mercedes absolutely I don't know, B4, it's actually not that bad, but a little drop down. Just one more lap and I'm gonna fix the overlay, guys. Because I believe the steering and throttle overlay is not uh, yet uh, in place. Still clean, still clean. Three tenths we found, noise. the way and he moves out of the way let's go okay eight tenths we found it's actually really good oh no, 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 no. Okay. This will be deleted. Let's go Yellow back to the pitch up. and fix a little Red bit of that. Uh, so did we have the, uh, let's see. Yeah, that's what I thought. There you go. So you can actually see what I'm doing. And I need a little bit of that. Uh, uh, let's see the setup. I need to change tires a little bit. A little bit more pressure on that right front. A little bit less on that left front. A little bit less on that one. And a little bit less brake bias. 53% people. That's not a lot. So, okay. So Sander, did you use the, uh, the video or like the presets uh, of like the levels from what the Merc, like the video that I made or was it just like plugging in and or you make your own or use them from Coach Dave or whatever? That one's kind of still, all right. Your brakes are cold, let's get some heat. So I, I believe we can improve by a second from what we have now. So Thunder Snapper, what's up, mate? Green flag in sector three. Gonna read that message from you, yeah. Moment. 
By the curbs reports a flyer rain air crash. MZ is sweet on the curbs, yes it is. The um it's very much uh understeering a lot. And um but once you get used to that and use the trail braking to get into these corners then yeah you could take it on a rally track maybe even if you put like the the proper tires on it yeah I just like the sound and I like the steering wheel and that VR environment that I have here I really like the Merc I like this so even even though a car isn't all that great, uh, there's always a way to drive it, and if you keep experimenting, then you will get away with it at some point. Yo, Plug Gamer, what's up, mate? This is the difficult corner. It's a bit slower than the previous lap, unfortunately. Oh, we can do this definitely way faster. Okay, Sander, yeah. I, I understand, yeah, it's a long video, you know, but at least you know it's there, yeah. Chicane, it looks pretty decent. Now this corner. So, we can improve by a lot, so we have P18, but... There's more, more in it. So this is like the first two ten that we already have, P13. We need to be in the top ten, that's will be the goal. P10 is the target. it there. <laughs> Yellow flag. Thunderstorm. Just two minutes left, two minutes to go. It's an clear green flag. Six two is not much six off the pace. Bro. like here on the right I see the chat um, I will respond to you as soon as I can yeah but first I need to have this quality lap in first okay this is a lot better 26 people what's fast lap time yeah this looks pretty okay We need to tackle that chicane properly. And we didn't, bro. Well, it looks still okay, I think. Of 
good three tens that's cutting this corner completely wrong but again we have two more two tens again that puts us on p15 not really happy with this but i didn't practice like nothing i did not do anything with setup so what can you expect just try the bmw and it's let's say interesting yes the bmw i drove it uh, last season i bought the ghost setups for the nissan now my main car i use the amg every day but nissan is funnier and the same speed as the amg yeah i like the nissan as well yeah i really like the nissan and i'm very satisfied with the ghost setups maybe because i don't drive it on the limit but ripper elke what's up mate thanks for joining in so the the um yeah well it's it's nice that you if you have like if you don't have to drive it on the limit and it can still work yeah so that's good i always like before when i started youtube channel i always had the coach dave academy setups and the application like always and then uh, when the 1.9 version came out uh, That's the end of the session. Uh, i was kind of fucked because uh, they could not deliver all the setups when the game came out with the new version so i had to do it myself and i got better at it started the youtube channel and here we are okay so Hopefully we're gonna have it a little bit clean here. It's gonna be a lot of Ferraris, a lot of McLarens, one Nissan, one Merc. It's just basically Ferraris and McLaren, so a lot of fantasy here, yeah. So if you're just plugging in, I'm gonna do this race and then if we go immediately to the Nürburgring as well. Uh this will be my last races of this season uh yeah so well, let's see to the fuel bro fuel mm. it's gonna be like 128 yeah 2.7 49 49 liters hey uh, and uh the ripper you made like a remix yeah of me saying like what kind of insane lap time you did on spa i was laughing like <laughs> that's really quick though okay tires look okay yeah pressures okay let's go <clears throat> I think we're gonna be in a better spot for uh, the Nurbur, the Nurbur ring though. Let's have a look. Forty, forty seconds, people. Forty seconds. Um. Yeah. The 75 millimeters. Well, definitely for the uh, for the Merc, yeah. If you go higher, then you get into uh, a lot of like unpredictable lift off oversteer on entry, and uh, that really spoils a race for you. So you cannot go higher with the Merc. <laughs> yeah, so that's good, yeah. Just this is a, a recipe for a good feeling. Search uh, a YouTuber, be faster than him, and then mock him in public. Yeah, it's good. I like it. <laughs> oh, I have a little bit of frame drops. Shit. But we can we can handle that, no problem. Do you like the overlays guys? It's just like uh more more clear. Not like that. Oh but it's okay, yeah. Uh, it's 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 just good good sport, good good humor. Okay, start. We need to have a clean start. Please, 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 please have a clean start. 
Please, everybody be on the best behavior. Oh, it's three white. Three white over there. Still there. Oh, this cannot be. Oh, yeah, that's the first one. All right. There. Well, we're okay, I think. Well, it might be a cut, even. It's not a cut? Okay, good. This could be. This is such a horrible corner. Look here, collision, collision, collision. We only took a few cars here. Still have that acceleration going and working for us. Yeah, freebies. <laughs> exactly. I don't need, cannot screw up ourselves here. Why is just push it so much to the inside, man? Like you wanna, like what he did, yeah? Like pushing it to the inside, like you wanna be rammed off. for now and then when we're in the switch over to the Nürburgring then I want to know what happened. Tell me already if you find a way to drive it with the wing off, then uh, I want to know. Good stuff, mate. Um, I'm, oh, it's always nice to have a base engineer and some help here in the chat or with me. I was not going to stream uh, this uh, two races. I normally I also always do them all by myself. But I thought to myself, like, hey, I can use a little bit of a streaming experience, so... So tag along for the ride, yeah. So P12, that looks pretty decent. Coming from... P16. Now, zero, three, zero. It's than us in, I think that BMW behind us is uh, going to be uh, okay, no, some no, company no, for us. Found some rhythm here. Nice 
the smooth of that throttle. Keep it balanced. That's 20 minutes to go. 20 minutes. Honda lover, yeah. I also... You know, I'm gonna promise you now, I'm gonna drive that Honda at some point. For a whole season. I promise. Oh, ooh, that was close. One cut. Car left. Still there. Clear left. One cut. She can't cut, bro. Hopefully this Ferrari is gonna crack at some point. It's really hard to overtake here. Oh, he's not running wide. He's running wide and now being basically stuck behind this okay, yellow banana. Oh yeah, me oversteering here also not optimal because we have the BMW behind us. Bro. Yellow flag, oh. Ah, we're gonna... On your left. Ah! There. We have the McLaren on the inside, on the Hold radar. Your line. There he is. Hold your line. Still there. No space for me, I see. Hold your line. God, from Pressure, people, under pressure. <laughs> yeah, McLaren, you already lost it, so I see the pressure he's in. It's good. Maybe we can benefit somehow. Yeah, I think. I think it's it can be nice to curse in Dutch every now and then, yeah? Just so everybody can see I'm still kind of human as well. Like overtaking a chicane. We have one track limit though. Yeah, not on the inside. Left side. Hold yeah. your line. What I can actually do here. At least we have the acceleration working for us. On your left. Yeah, send it. Nice. Awesome. What do I need to do here, guys? Left side. Left. It's like they stacking up behind us and I could not overtake the Ferrari and because I couldn't do that we lost two positions but this McLaren and this BMW are also still behind him so we need to think about a longer play here maybe I can take this positions back Maybe they will, it will stay like this. We have still P12 though. Any tips, chat, how to overtake these annoying people in front of us? Or 
where I need to do it. Car right, clear right. Right side. I wasn't expecting that he sent it from there. send it yeah well I have a little bit of a horrible experience here sending it really hard but um, maybe more freebies that would be nice I really like that curb with this car because if you do that in a Ferrari then you'll be in the grass and crashing this Merc is just like oh, what's that what was that like a no idea how much people are behind us like closing the gap <laughs> hopefully everybody can stay on their best behavior it is good this sounds awesome mate that's the biggest problem that i have with the nissan because that's that's like that's not an engine you hear that's the gearbox you hear corners in this game but if you can nail it absolutely right then it's also the most satisfying corner b12 still we have one point of contact and we have one track limit is holding everybody up. Enjoy Ebola a whole lot. I can be pretty consistent there. Over here we also I think we should not complain. P12 split one. I mean what are we talking here? Maybe not the fastest people in these lobbies for now at this moment, but And if it's split one and I'm carrying number seven, that's also a sign that the FOSS people are absolutely not in this lobby. So afraid to cut that chicane. today and I was P7 instead of P3 off territory all right it's good yeah I 
I think that's that leak race you're doing. That's like a pretty hard uh, leak race, yeah, like high high level. What's up, mate? Barzat, how are you doing, mate? Welcome to the stream. After this, we're gonna do the Nurburgring, 45 minutes. I wasn't going to do a stream. Normally, I would do this race all by myself, but tonight, I thought to myself, why not stream it? I'm kind of stuck behind these uh, Ferrari and McLaren and this Merc. Oh, the McLaren has now actually overtook the, uh, the Ferrari now, I can see. So then, I wasn't able to do that, so... Hopefully we, we can overtake him. Because the Ferrari is holding everybody up here. Look to the inside, mate. Come on. Come on, Merc. Where's that power of yours? Limits, no track limits. And we have the inside. Come on. Oh, Now we have that yellow banana still to do. Clean overtake, yeah. Outside, inside. I like it. I am loving it. I need to actually get away from him as well because. Because he's like still really close. Smooth lines. A little bit of a gap now. Ooh, a little bit of a breaking. Push, push, yeah. Now this Ferrari as well, yeah. Ah. Very slow on that corner. Every time that BMW is catching up in that corner, yeah. Yes, Little Mac, I'm okay, man. How are you doing? How's life treating you? That Ferrari. That's five minutes to go. Oh, he's wide. He's under pressure. 
We are white as well. Use dirt through the chicane. Oh, really? Okay, I will try. Michael Bilavsky, what is up, mate? Welcome to the chat. Yeah, mate. I'm on the inside here. What's up? Give it up. That's what I thought. Let's go, people. Now not fuck up this corner. And hold everybody up now behind us, yeah? Don't let everybody pass so I can now like be in a, like a nice comfortable position. I don't know if we have time to overtake these boys in front of us. Three minutes left only. Is the BMW is also already overtook that Ferrari. Bro. Oh, smooth sailing in that third gear uh, plug game. Uh, thanks for the nice tip. After this, we have the, the Nürburgring, yeah? 45 minutes. Hopefully, it's gonna be as clean as well. P10 we have at the moment. It's pretty... Pretty decent. I wish I could say that every race is going so smoothly as this one, because every time I'm plugging in the stream, everything is like, like, like everybody knows. Yeah. Oh, be careful of Arnaud because he's streaming. That will give me a bad reputation if I hit Arnaud off while he's streaming. But I don't think that magic is gonna keep going forever. So let's see. Maybe in the next race it will be a bit more unlucky. Two minutes to go in two minutes. There's a chicane, yeah. There's a, it, like. That's good. It's fast. I like it. Just like sliding it in that corner. At 27.5, its lap times are pretty decent. That's all 27.6. So we have another Ferrari in front of us. Ah, it's gonna be the last lap after this one. All right, Arno. Five minutes of fuel remaining. Five minutes. A little bit of a mistake. Oh, troubles. A Nissan or oh, poor guy. Oh, sorry, third gear, bad habits. Stewards have warned us about track limits. Keep it between the lines. One track limit. Endurance race, Blue Gamer. Yeah, we we can definitely have a chat about that. 
Like you're taking like three hours, four and a half. Green flag, sector two. One more lap to go. You think I'm, I'm like capable enough? I need to be in VR though. People say that, yeah, VR, you can only do like 45 minutes of VR. I can do a whole night of VR, no issues, no problem. Everything is automatic when I have the headset on. Gonna make a video about VR racing as well, why it's so beneficial. Smooth sailing, P9, it's good, yeah. Not a lot of ELO gain, but... Oh, that's a cut, or not? Yeah, that was a cut, a little bit too much. But we had, like, we still can do one more, but that will be the finish. So that's good, yeah? So let's go to that next lobby and look at the chat and uh, talk with a little bit of people because I was really focusing. And go to the other one. Um, yeah, it was a very solid run, uh, Swindlemack. Absolutely uh, like smooth sailing. Uh, let's see where we have the this one. Now we go to the Nürburgring. Nürburgring Nürburgring Where? And then we can start uh, right away on the Nürburgring In split one as well Low fuel motorsports This is why I love low, your low fuel motorsports so much You know, because it can plug in every time I want We have 30 seconds left in the free practice BMW time, yeah, BMW time. Let, tell me, Taga, how do you like the Mercedes? Uh, it's awesome. I like it. I like it a lot. I found a way to set it up, and uh, actually, uh, now it's all like rainbows and unicorns, basically. And we have the super weapon, which is the curb. So we actually gonna enjoy that here as well. And our target lap time on the Nurburgring will be check it flags out. B twenty seven. Uh, a one. 53 and that will be then my first one maybe i can get it all right first you need to get past ferrari and then north slide <laughs> all right good stuff ah now do you have big plans for the north slide i mean setups drag guides etc um michael uh bilovsky if i'm pronouncing it right um I have a lot of people I hear they gonna stream and they're gonna make content about the Nordschleife and I'm so busy next week so I'm not really sure if I'm gonna make content next week but I'm definitely gonna drive it a whole lot and it's track guides if you could if you see how good people make the track guides and the video editing that goes into it I mean I cannot replicate that but i do have like a mindset about the nordschleife what you need to have in front of your mind when you're like also exploring the nordschleife because uh if you would normally drive like 95 percent on your limit you should actually go for like 85 percent or 80 percent of your limit and just focusing on being on the tarmac instead of pushing pushing hard to make that perfect lap time because it that the track is so big it requires a little bit of a different strategy i believe i drove the north slife uh, a whole bunch on forza 7 so i know the layout i know what's happening uh but yeah so so the bmw is actually quite fun to drive setup looks the same on a very high wing tracks setup seems very meta min max everything rear ride heights generally even Break by is super low, okay, yeah. 
yeah because it's not uh turning in that well yeah so you can get a very low break bias i i understand what you're saying good game daga my f favorite car i really enjoy it nice nice man good to hear i will uh, load up the setup and uh, do a few laps here level five this one this setup i'm uh, sharing also on that video that i made um last week so i actually used this setup to uh and i didn't even have the optimal pressure so imagine what we can do 27 degrees i'm also still working on a way to get the setup stuff for you in the screen as well yeah because now you cannot see it but i didn't figure it out yet so so let's go for uh, a few laps thank you Taga. thank you appreciate it making these videos um, like once it's done i think well that was that was pretty good to do but i actually procrastinate a lot before i make those videos because i don't want to disappoint you know right this player in here what are you doing man okay maybe a bit more traction control for warm-up lap but understeer we have don't have the temperatures yet Hey John Gromis, what's up man? Welcome to the stream. So we have still 45 minutes left on this nerve track we just did Donington Park. I was not doing a whole lot of streams like this, but tonight I thought hey why not? Because I was going to drive them anyway and I thought like why why don't I go live and chat a little bit with people rolling in. I need to change some settings because I have a lot of frame drops of this weather somehow. This is a hard corner. Oh, this is so hard. This Good luck, I'm doing a race now. Okay, man, see you later, man. That's a little bit too much. Okay. Let's get in a banker lap first. Light on the brakes here. Yeah. Okay, but well that's a good idea. Let's try it out. I'm also very much struggling in this corner as well. Every time I'm gonna say I'm struggling in a corner, Blue Gamer comes up with awesome tips, so I'm gonna struggle. I struggle everywhere now, uh, Blue Gamer. <laughs> Let's see what uh, kind of a banker lap we can get. rotation when I'm keeping it in third gear. Sector 2 is 1.1 seconds off the pace. 1.1 seconds off the pace. 
55, okay, we have a... Uh, we are super slow. So, with the trees, I'm already losing the confidence that we can get into the 53s, but let's see. feels a lot faster. Off second, at least 54.8. Maybe the chicane we can gain a little bit. not looking good but we are like 29 okay still a little bit this is faster than earlier setup at least is pretty decent Here we can gain, we can definitely. So, three tenths. Oh, we're just gonna keep going and going. again 54.4 so we actually need to build up that lap time yeah because it doesn't come that easy for me right from the get-go ah. oh miss shifting bro
Okay, screwing this up. Maybe if we can get a traction control off, we can maybe improve again. It's in the sector three. Sector three is yellow. We're running on fumes, mate. Like yeah, we can three. do one more lap and then um, mm. Swindle Mac. Yeah, got to go. Yo, Swindle Mac. Goodbye, man. Thanks for tuning in. What's up, mate? How's your evening? Later, Apex. Yeah, we're still early now in this corner. You're right. So I need to crank down the video resolution here a little bit. So hopefully it will be better now. Okay. It was good. We had an Easter barbecue in my back garden. Oh, nice, man. It's uh, you had like the heaters and stuff, yeah, because it's quite cold. <sighs> Michael Bilovsky, you are fast guy and still two seconds off the pace this is crazy yeah but this is split one lfm so uh so yeah and that's why uh sometimes we forget that it doesn't matter how fast you are there will always be guys that will be faster than you yeah so and uh these these guys they uh, i don't know how much time they put in but uh yeah so P29, we're carrying race number 26. So it's gonna be. <sighs> oh, we're already on 30. Bruh. I was po I was hoping for uh, like a 53.9, but it's absolutely uh, way out of my league. So. Keep the chat English so everybody understands, okay? <laughs> if I start speaking Dutch, then everybody will laugh at me. Yeah, it's for such a horrible Dutch accent. So, and uh, I'm absolutely thrilled. We have 33 people in the uh, in the chat, which is amazing. And um, so for everybody who's like uh, just tuned in, uh, we have another 45 minutes to for the uh, Nürburgring track. And then after that, we can maybe joke around a bit or whatever. We'll see. Uh, so I wasn't able to do a good qualifying here, but we are in split one. And I really feel that this um, lobby is a little bit out of my league. So we're now in P31. Uh, setup wise I'm pretty happy uh, we're definitely gonna run traction control 3 and we have the setup yeah okay. so and this is actually the setup that I'm using is from that video we could try the beam that was after haha haha yeah yeah we could yeah we could or, or, the, or like a Honda we can make a Honda preset that would be good like a special Honda because you're like a Honda guy, yeah? <laughs> okay, good. So we have one more minute left. Let's see if we have... Okay, there's a few cars. This is the last one. A lot of McLarens. Okay. All right. 
so 45 minutes yeah pit stop we have oh man i didn't practice uh didn't, didn't practice the, the pit minute. entry bro stupid <laughs> so maybe maybe somebody can like coach me a little bit into that uh Entry of the pit uh, when we need Track to do the pit stop. Track temp is 28. The air temp is 21 Celsius. Tire pressures wise, guys, did we have the proper pressures? I don't remember. I don't remember. Oh, it was a little bit uh, clumsy of me. Okay. Um. 76 liters in total. I like the first stint a bit longer, yeah? Wendell Somerville, man. Welcome to the stream, mate. Welcome. Glad to have you here. I'm uh, doing another 45 minute race on the Nürburgring. We just did Donington Park. We ended like P6, P7, I believe. Uh, P8 or P9, I don't know. Top 10 at least. And um, now we're gonna do a 45 minutes, but I'm actually way, way underdog here in this. Let's just call it an alien lobby. Let's see. 45, 35. All right. Do we have we have 10 seconds left then we can uh, do a warm-up lap in the Merc 30 seconds all right let's go Jay Seilstra some people crash in the start you could do well yeah yeah we'll see but we, we we also should also not be in that crash that will be uh, like important yeah that that we are not in that crash <laughs> so yeah uh, the uh, stream streaming wise the um, the races have been pretty clean but I can promise you it's not always rainbows and unicorns Mate at Urban Sim Racing. Thanks, mate. Let's uh, first we have the warm up lap, yeah, so we can joke around a bit still and then uh, full focus 45 minutes. I like the longer races, it gets me more in the rhythm. I like the tire wear component of it. Fuel levels. Look at that livery of that BMW, man. This Porsche also looks pretty nice. Speed up this stuff. Hopefully the pressures will be okay. Hopefully it's not gonna be so sweaty, you know, that everybody's like pushing to the max. I'm actually considering just to be on the back and get that like safety rating up, but that will be obviously I will lose all the viewers if I do that. So I actually need to like push and be like competitive, yeah. I wish this warm-up laps could be a bit faster. Yeah, it's like first gear.
Now we actually have some temperature in these tires and in the brakes. Let's heat them up a bit more. We need to follow car number 36. 36. Okay, man. Now it's gonna start. So do you uh, like the overlays, guys? How everything is looking? I got the race lab apps and uh, in combination with the Aramentario overlays. So you can actually see uh, what is happening. Good evening, Freddy. What's up, mate? Good evening. I was thought I'd just do a stream, last LFM race of the season, yeah. And I'm uh, split one here, an absolute underdog, so... I'm already... Oh, well, that's already the start, mate. It's starting in a corner almost, all the way at the back. A lot of drama is gonna happen probably in this corner, so we need to be on edge. There's a big gap we can fly into here. We're gonna actually gonna do that. Okay, parking lot. Parking lot. Now all the way to the outside. Oh, Boston. What? What? Okay, Did you see that, mate? Oh my god. There's like only like a like a millimeter space left. Ah, uh, we're still in a horrible position. Come on, people! Again, we avoided like another hit because it's Aston Martin. Look how nice that paintwork is from his car. Right side. Hold your line. You're in the middle. Three wide. Clear all round. P30. Who oh, checked the Honda? Yeah, too late, mate. Right. Oh, there's somebody going off. Oh, they make sure of that re entry, mate. Okay, good. I think we um, are lucky with this uh, race start. We're, we're in a good spot. We're in a good spot. You know, I had the chat uh, in VR and it's absolutely in that apex. <laughs> so I can need to see through the chat to hit the apex. I believe this uh, 36 Austin uh, is also a very much an underdog, this guy in front of us, so we actually gonna need to overtake him. Look, he's over, over here as well, mid corner speed, a bit slower. Yeah, what to do now, yeah? Take me out. Oh, almost, yeah. Come on, man. Come on. It's taking way too much time. Oh, no, he's losing it over here as well. Look at that gap, man. We should have been in that gap in front of us. You see that? That gap. That way we would have 
we should be there, like, you know? front of us. Oh, there's a lot of battling going on. We have a car behind us, the Honda. We overtook him, but we're stuck, yeah, so... We also need to think about this race a little bit holistically. I mean, we have all these guys in front, they're pushing and squeezing. It, it will be a very likable scenario if we can just get more freebies because I'm just stealing that uh, freebies words of you uh, the Ripper because this is a nice way of saying that we get positions for free What I found, I did like, uh, like when I was driving this car a whole lot, I really felt that tire wear is so unaffected. The balance of the car just almost not changing of this uh, mirror, so that's really beneficial for what's about to come. Nice exit. Austin's quick, yeah. So yeah, just push. Oh, okay. Wait, we're gonna need to break early here because they're gonna have contact. Uh, okay. Still there. Clear left. On your left. Clear left. You're looking your right front into turn one. Very unpredictable driving of this Austin. very hard to overtake this boy. Come on, mate. Stay close. Wait for him to make a mistake. So, any tips for overtaking this Aston Martin, people? I would like to know. So the Honda behind us joining the party. I actually need to really be stupid with the brake and the throttle in that corner because I also will hit that Austin in front of me. A mind punt? What do you mean? Left side. Hold your line. Hold your line. Hold your line. Hold your line. Oh, we have this car Hold next to us. Now he's us. Now he's ours. All right. That's, but that was not the plan. I want to overtake this, but this Aston Martin in front of me. Oh, 
freebie. Yes. Oh, two more freebies. We think about rejoining you, idiots. All right. So P22. Still have the pit stops to do though. Uh, not good, not good, not good, not good. Yellow flag. Ah, come on, I'm out, bro. Mistakes were made, people. That's it, daddy. Unfortunately, Ooh. I was almost afraid that he was gonna hit that post that were there. Maybe another send, yeah? What are we thinking here? Left side. Clear left. this too early of the apex uh. so I'm gonna give that Austin a, a lot of credit because he's uh, a little bit more consistent than me. Although he was a bit slower in the first part of the stint. Our first cut. Right, just cut the track. Okay, that's actually a cut. Oscar have we could have done that a lot better. Maybe we can get into the 54s and actually build up some pace because we're losing the guys in front of us. There's a lot of drama behind us as well. Okay, my friends, all right. I wasn't able to look at that message, uh, Blue Gamer, for quite some time too, because I need to focus here a little bit. Extra. They're actually disappearing. I cannot keep up. Unbelievable. is just giving up like okay I cannot keep up so the McLaren overtakes him oh. so that's our first 54 that's half fuel you've used half your fuel 
Yeah, but I'm driving a lot of LFM, so that's maybe the reason as well. We have a Bentley joining the party here. So the setup that I'm using is actually quite nice because I can go on the throttle and the throttle is making that rotation possible on that exit so it really feels nice. Second gear would be nice as well for that corner. So, does anyone know how is that uh, pit exit structure, or the fixed entry structures? Oh, he's missing his apex. Yeah, okay, we have the inside. Keep it clean. That is one of the hardest things to do, to focus on your apex and your positioning and also have like a, a, a like a one eye on that radar, like how, how is he actually, so we have that position. And now we need to move up. Oh, missing it, oh, come on. Was that BNB? Be the freeze. It's probably a country like somebody from the same country as me. You've got ten minutes of fuel remaining. Just had a warning for cutting the track. Okay, so it wasn't actually a cut, we still have one cut, so. BMW behind me is super quick. Again, yeah, that exit of that corner. <laughs> Come on. We distracted defensive position. They're faster than us in two. Uh, oh, 
the pit uh, entry will be uh, will be an absolute coward. I'm gonna be super super careful because oh I have like stop and go of speeding in pit lanes absolutely unnecessary. Okay, I think that will be our pit stop as well, yeah. Bro. Unfortunately, we had to lose it. Yeah, somebody took the sign off. Oh, no, here it is. New front's going into turn 15. Look out for the pit speed limit. Okay, I oh, know. Expect traffic when you exit the pits. We should come out into position 25, really close to B26 and B25. Hopefully it will be good. Come on. Yes. Press on the back were too high. But it wasn't the spin, yeah? Shame, yeah. Well. I'm also human, you know. I made a mistake. It happens. What can you do? I, I, I like make I like this these kinds of things. It's also like one in every like five races. I was just pushing too hard, basically. So final stint. B24. Dirty. Oh my god, yeah. Very costly mistake. Very costly mistake. Imagine, yeah, one spin and you're the last. Well, I'm gonna keep going. mistake I think I just over pushed it uh, too hard on the uh, chicane, so it's breaking points uh, somewhere between those uh, 1500 meters. And uh, if I do that later, then I get into trouble. I was just looking. Last place. Bruh. I spun. I spun, mate. I spun in the chicane, throwing every that all that hard work away, basically. Understand? Come on, man. So I did a pit stop as well, yeah. So I spun in the chicane and I did the pit stop. what it is I oh, we still have 
20 minutes to go, so let's see, maybe there's something possible. And it was a one-sided accident, so it could be a lot, lot worse. I'm just gonna find some rhythm and try to improve lap time. We have no pressure from behind and uh, maybe we can catch up a bit, who knows. No damage, no, no just a spin, I just uh, pushed it a bit too hard and uh, just a spin, that's all. But obviously we had to restart the engine and do like a proper re-enter, so... You know in the split once, yeah, if you make one mistake, you're lost. The guys in front are way longer on their tires because they had probably had to pit really early. So maybe something is possible. I don't believe, by the way, that this car in front of me is slower than me. It's probably very hard to overtake. Number three in front of us. And that I want to pronounce that guy in front of me but that last name is absolutely so I have no clue how to pronounce that probably Polish or something Ukraine maybe Russian even okay, these nice exits also don't really help so P30 At least maybe we can overtake a Porsche, who knows? I'm actually not on the pace. I don't know how it is possible, but uh, the video that I made about the setups for this Merc, I actually cannot reproduce those lap times. Again, here, 55.5. Absolutely way too slow for this lobby. So it reflects my position as well. Celsa, yeah, maybe, yeah, maybe, but also like okay, some uh, finesse, yeah, some precision, maybe. Ooh, what's happening here? So it's never too, 
like it's never too late yeah because now uh, we have two free positions again this Porsche is like dead meat come on mate we can overtake him yeah more freebies that's good yeah let's let's make a uh, like a chat emoji like freebies that would be a good idea yeah It's definitely finding some pace. Uh, maybe the chicane here will struggle, we'll see. It. Come on, man. This Porsche now. Now we're gaining, yeah, because this is Porsche weakness. All right. Hold your line. Does it fit? Still there. It fits. Stay right. Well done, now keep the insides. Nice Don't give him the opening. He's going for it. Yeah, of course, man. Well, let's try again, shall we? It's not my mistake, it's his mistake. <laughs> yeah. Oh, like, you know, that's like it's very hard to correct your inputs and corner sequence in the middle of that chicane. So that could have gone really bad, real fast. He's standing right. still over here, mate. He's also pretty quick. It's not like he's slow or anything. It just had like a bad few corners.
AM is like 54, 54.8, 54.5, we should actually do. What do you think guys, can we next time maybe bring a little bit less fuel, yeah? Wasn't really paying attention, I was going to change it, but uh, yeah, I didn't. Mistake. Fifty-five point three. Oh oh oh. We are catching the guys in front, though. Could be interesting finale. So, uh, away from that mistake, you know, I can drive this car like forever now, you know, this I really don't really feel this is a lot of work or extremely complicated I um, do lacking a little bit of pace here and there but I think it's just a matter of driving it more find some sweet spots in the setup maybe I'm actually struggling quite a lot in the long corners over here I really feel I like could do it a little bit better because the Porsche over here he's like really gaining on me Maybe that's the setup thing. And now I'm starting to get really nervous because we have this epic battle in front of us and this is can only end one way and that is in tears. Breaking super early here to create some margin. uncertain if I'm d making a right decision here being in the sandwich it's number 35 Lambo he has some damage good yeah Ripper come on man now this one pick the number two has damage yeah so maybe top speed wise he will suffer a little bit on your left clear left bro I actually had to lift there to avoid contact
You make a mistake, yes. You already made a mistake, but I'm also made a mistake. That's how the cars are at this point. Let's chase that Honda down now. A little bit of ABS. ABS interfering hard. So I can actually feel on the haptic motors that I'm just asking too much of the front tires in that corner. So many cold grounds. <laughs> Why, man? Have a little bit of faith in me, okay? We'll be okay. All under control. <laughs> Although not at that moment when I spun, but that's the whole different story. Let's just forget about that. Yeah, we need to look forward. Now, that Honda, come on. Fifty-four people, we need fifty-four lap time. So catching that Honda might not be that straightforward because it can actually not get closer. And if we're not even getting closer, then overtaking is an whole other story. Closing the gap is one thing, but overtaking is something else. This 55 lap times, it's absolutely really frustrating. I mean, maybe some last lap drama here. Honda going on the outside. Oh, contact. Oh, 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 the Maka lost it. Where is he? Where is he? Aha, but we're not. We don't have any mercy here. <laughs> nice save though. Nice save from him. <laughs> Don't try it, mate. Don't try it. Let's 
it the blue flagger benchmarker? Oh, so we have B25. Come on, man. Left side. Still there. Clear left. Oh, yes, damage. Oh, this McLaren, he's angry. He is angry. Don't hit me, mate. He's really desperate. He's really desperate. That was the blue flag, no, but he had probably a lot of damage. Still, even though we made a mistake, we're still at B24, which is unbelievable, actually. Having this horrible pace and being on B24, still pretty good. One already finished. But oh, this also doesn't help, does it? Fuel levels are quite okay, actually. Five liters left. It's pretty good. Okay, that's the end. So pretty what was it like? B24. What? All right. Nice. <laughs> so, Chad, what do you think? Was it a nice race? Yeah, it was a good race. Yeah. It was pretty good. I'm happy. Still, still we did spin. Maybe we can have a look at the replay. Yeah, let's do analyze what happened. Good race at the end. Yes, definitely uh, the Ripper. Definitely, it was definitely. Uh, it could have gone a lot, lot worse after that. So a lot of other people also made mistakes. Alexander Rossi, yes, man, it was a nice race. I will, um, I will look at the replay from this race. Let's see what's happening. Um, so, okay. Shut this down. Shut the race lap app down. Close and then we restart the game. John Rambo. Yeah. Beautiful race, still. So let's push this in front and we can go back to. I'm going to make overlays here for the streaming. Yeah, so. So uh, let's see. So here we have the. Let's have a look what happened. 
Mm. Yeah, you like it, uh, Ripper. I'm, I'm. To be honest, I think my videos perform better than the, or I, I think I'm better at making videos than making streams, but. Uh, Um, no, I, I, well, they're still in place, uh, Rossi, but I just, I don't use them. This, this is way better. This sounds way better. So that's the reason why I'm using those. So, uh, at race start, have a look. This is the cam, yeah? This is the, the, the cam we want to go for. This is the start. Let's go back a few clicks. So the stock was not that super exciting, yeah? And let's check out this livery, yeah? Uh, GW Designs made it for me. And uh, he's also going to make one of the McLaren. So it's going to be the same style of livery for the McLaren. And I donated him some money. Maybe he can make more of them. So this Austin. Oh, look at, oh, look at that, mate. You remember that? Unbelievable. So what happened? Happened over here? Ah, oh, it happened over there. Yeah, what do you guys think? I mean, it needs a Frisian flag. <laughs> Yeah, but I, I like if somebody comes from Groningen, they also need to use the livery. Yeah? And if I put the Frisian flags, then I will lose half of the population. <laughs> so this was like, what do you guys think? This is an absolute driver mistake. Yeah. Too late on the brakes. Up. And that Maka, like that's his actually going there. So he's not really having a lot of pain from this. Is he? That's it. So lucky for him, yeah. What hap what was happening? I'm gonna show the spin as well. Where am I? So I'm actually taking a lot of evasive action here as well. Ah, oh, like, like a, only like a little bit, yeah. So I also want to explain what I'm doing here because I thought it was quite smart. Um, especially in this opening uh, laps I'm having the screen on top yeah that's why I'm looking up so over here as well I want to break into that space yeah and that's why that's how I'm overtaking this Honda actually now that Honda also takes that space I actually didn't overtake him he actually overtakes the Austin like this but over here as well uh, breaking into that space you know, in the split that I'm, that I'm driving, I'm actually feel confident to do that because they, these people can actually drive really well. Yeah, that was really close. Yeah, uh, Alexandra, that's that like. Ooh, look at this. That's a great overtake, actually. But he made a mistake. Yeah. What's happening? Oh yeah, he made a mistake, so yeah. Like, and you could see him, like, hesitant, I'm gonna push the inside, but I was like, ooh, next time I can give a bit more space, maybe. And then it's just basically chasing this Austin Martin down. And then here, all that uh, good stuff happens with the spin, yeah? So if we take the... Uh, So this is the Blue Gamer, if you're here, this is the mistake, what was happening. The chicane, I believe. <laughs> so this is what happens. Too late on the brakes. And then I went to the pit. 
little bit of a shame. Very costly though. Very costly. And then we have another highlight somewhere. Somewhere. It's Porsche. Yeah. Painful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Painful. So did I actually? I'm not sure. Where was it? We had some fights with him. This was beautiful. But then, then this happened. My mistake, I'm keeping the gap here. He's actually pushing it inside of here. Ah. It's his fault, yeah? Is it? Is it his fault? Let, let's, look, let's look from his perspective. Uh, let's see how this is uh, now he's like hey schaffer it was you <laughs> What's up, man? Welcome. I, I was doing this to you in the race. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Not sorry. Really? I'm joking. Or am I? I don't know. <laughs> it's just, it was the competition, yeah. So, let, 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 and then after I, I got you, so. Yeah, but you too, yeah? You, you, you control this, this, uh, you control this, uh, Porsche really well. It's really good. Um, where were we? So, respect for that, because I know how hard it is to drive. Then we had some banter, and that uh, was taking quite some more laps. I'm, I'm actually don't know what happened. Oh yeah, then we get all this stuff. This is actually a pretty good line to exit it up into this corner. Hey, Bram de Vries! Yeah, you were there as well. The freeze. This is awesome, man. Everybody is in here. How cool. So this, oh, I'm totally missing this overtake. I was, you know, I was actually kind of, when this happened, I kind of like... Break, I was losing my breaking point here, so, but luckily it turned into an overtake, but, yeah, so. Yeah, and you struggle with the Porsche on that straight, yeah, that, that, that's lost 75%, and that Porsche is really slowing you down, yeah, on the straight, I believe, that's, that's what I feel with the, with the Porsche as well. Hey, it's Iron Man, what's up, man, welcome to the stream. Same dive, but you didn't go wide and kept it on the curb. Bram de Vries. Oh, yes. Uh, you're behind me? Okay, just let's continue this. So we, and then we got like the uh, Lamborghini. Oh, Elson, we overtook. He has actually, he didn't make it very hard for me though. And I saw them took the last corner like you to gain more speed, yeah. Yeah, it's a great uh, maneuver in that corner. It's really good. Oh, we have uh, Bram de Vries is behind me at some point, I believe. But I was also battling with him? I, I have no clue. I don't know anymore. Oh. Okay, yeah, time. Good, good. <laughs> so, Shaffer, uh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm exhausted. This is it. But it was nice uh, racing you, man. Hope to see you again sometime. Have a great, have a great evening. Yeah, yes. Okay, yeah, uh, Br yeah, yeah, Bram. Yes, yeah, I, uh, I mistaked uh, the chicane. 
Over here I take that line as well again and then we get into this uh, next corner. I will overtake him and that's basically it. Yeah, pretty straightforward, nothing special. So yeah okay so uh bram and uh yeah he will be behind me and i lost it yeah but uh, anyways you were uh you were pressuring me into this mistake so i think it's like you made you made me force that mistake because you were like chasing me down yeah it was it's yeah but i'm actually not really happy with the pace because i uh did like 54s, 54 3, 54 4 uh, in the practice sessions, and now I'm actually incapable of doing 54s. So, but maybe that's the conditions, I don't know. So, yeah, that's basically uh, this is basically it. Let's see, so, um the North Slife is coming on the 1st of April, so it's gonna be the day after tomorrow. And I'm not really sure what to do because I feel like every freaking YouTuber is gonna be like doing this. So, how am I adding something to this mix? You know, maybe I'm gonna make a video about it or whatever. Yeah, it was it was not really super hot. It was normal conditions. Let me just quit this. Uh, let's see. So yeah, and uh, maybe we can have a look at the Donington as well. Why not? And then I'm gonna stop it here we actually didn't make a mistake it was a great start this one uh, here we were in p let's see the p16 and we ended like p9 i was really afraid for this to something that uh, would happen yeah this corner and this BMW goes off oh, it's such a horrible corner to lose it oh and the Wegman oh he has like a drive through like jump start struggling here as well yeah <laughs> I have no clue anymore what happened here just chasing this uh, yellow Ferrari yeah that was what we did it's absolutely Bruh, and then the cars behind me overtook me. What's happening here? Oh yeah. So, so you like like imagine this scenario, yeah? You <laughs> look at this, all these cars. So here we are, like looking at this you know and then just one person makes contact that uh and then the other one and then you just need to hope that the guys behind you are actually slowing down it's like one point of contact is like six collisions happening and we get like we gain a lot of positions here like quite a lot noise or maybe this is a great camera to look at it so with all these collisions like it's really hard to see how much was but quite quite a few like three or four of them <laughs> 
I did a race in the 30 degrees, I couldn't even get into the 44s. What uh, kind of track you mean, uh, Siam? Yeah, so, and uh, what we have left, so we have the... Uh, what I'm doing now, screwing this up. I see some people like, oh, I already know what it is. Yeah, okay, good. So, basically, constantly behind this... Uh, this Ferrari. And then this McLaren comes into the mix as well. He overtakes him at some point. The BMW, we, he overtook me as well. Yeah. But I'm the freeze, yes, but you know, you know how it is, yeah? If you just keep chasing and then sometimes you think or i think like uh push harder and then you make a mistake yeah okay ram yo see you mate thanks for plugging in see you maybe next time so yeah and then uh we actually overtook this bmw again oh what happened there He's taking this very smoothly. Very early on my break, breaking here. Oh, he actually lost the position. Ah, oh, this is actually very beneficial for us then. Yeah. Okay. Well, there was not a lot of other stuff happening, I believe. So, we overtook these guys. This was a nice overtake. On the outside. Oh, oh yeah. A little bit of squeezing. <laughs> so yeah, good stuff. So uh, guys, I will uh, wrap it up. I want to thank everyone uh, who was plugging in so this were the last races for me as well on the lfm calendar we have an off season week i don't know what lfm is gonna do with the north's life i'm probably gonna hit that track uh maybe we're gonna maybe i'm gonna partner up with like jeff from the sim cafe or maybe casey from road to racer i don't know i'm not sure yet but uh check the discord um if there's gonna be something up i will definitely say it in the discord so this absolutely uh like be there so you know what's happening what's going on vandal well thanks man appreciate it it's um the live streams they maybe don't look very professional but the videos i'm really putting a lot of effort into them to make them as helpful as possible and uh probably i'm gonna make some about the nord's life as well how we can like mentally attack that track yeah because i think a lot of videos that we have online on the youtube and like how to improve they're all like with exercises and what you actually need to do but i feel there is a lot of stuff missing what needs to happen in your brain before you like start racing you know i really feel like racing a lot of times you're in a hurry you know you're like in a hurry to be on throttle or be in a hurry to like go super fast on a straight line but sometimes uh, there's a lot of patience in sim racing needed as well and it's very overlooked so maybe that will be helpful just strange love just popping in to say your videos have helped me a great deal thank you thanks man appreciate it this these comments uh, you know they they never get old i really like that people coming in and and say this because it actually took a lot of time to to make them but uh yeah appreciate it man awesome so yeah um i'm gonna wrap it up join the discord leave a like maybe if you want to subscribe all those things 
Thanks, guys. See you in the next stream or video.